for all of those who came here today to boldly answer this communal call to action. Hello everyone, my name is Rosine Azap and I'm a second year medical student here at The Ohio State University College of Medicine. Hello everyone, my name is Deborah Fadoju and I'm a second year medical student at The Ohio State University College of Medicine. Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Wando Olaiwala. I'm professor and chair of the Department of Family and Community Medicine at The Ohio State University College of Medicine in Columbus, Ohio. Our paper, Sounding the Alarm, Six Strategies for Medical Students to Champion Anti-Racism Advocacy is a recipe for good trouble. Every year, incoming medical students take the Hippocratic Oath and they pledge that they will be an advocate for patients in need and strive for justice in the care of the sick. However, guidance on how to engage in community and public health advocacy is not a mandatory component of medical education and students often feel insufficiently qualified to engage in advocacy efforts. As the nation has struggled with a viral pandemic and witnessed an uprising against anti-Black racism and police brutality, it became immediately apparent that activism that marries medicine to anti-racism advocacy was needed. We deduce that anti-racism activism and medical institutions would need to position medical students, often low in the medical hierarchy, as very essential to the response. With the support of our leaders and mentors, we galvanize medical students to become front and center in advocacy efforts. In this paper, we outline six key strategies for how medical students across the nation can engage in anti-racism advocacy efforts. One, embrace a common agenda. Two, establish a formal structure. Three, engage affinity groups and allies. Four, endorse legislative action. Five, encourage curricular reform. Six, enrich the pipeline. It is our hope that medical students will feel empowered and activated to lead and organize efforts that will ultimately improve the lives and the health of the communities and the patients that they are being trained to serve. Medical students, after reading our paper, we hope that you will go out there and make good, good trouble. trouble.